Welcome to the Best Practices series, where we provide quick, actionable tips to help you maximize your testing efficiency with CASE. In this video, we shall delve into the heart of efficient test case management with a focus on organizing your repository in CASE. Let's explore the significance of a well-structured repository, methodologies to achieve this, types of organizations, and of course, real-world examples to keep things engaging. In the realm of test case management, an organized repository isn't just a nice-to-have, it's a game-changer. A well-structured repository ensures clarity, ease of access, and seamless collaboration among team members. Let's delve into why this matters and how it significantly impacts your testing endeavors. Imagine your repository as the blueprint of your testing landscape. A well-organized repository brings clarity to the intricate web of test cases, making it easier for every team member to comprehend the testing scope. It's also like having a well-arranged library where each book is in its designated section. This clarity translates to a more profound understanding of what needs to be tested and how. In the collaborative realm of testing, communication is key. An organized repository acts as a universal language that everyone in your team can speak. When your test cases are neatly arranged into folders, which in case are termed as suites and subsuites, it becomes simpler for team members to collaborate, share insights, and collectively contribute to the testing effort. It's akin to having a roadmap that everyone can follow with ease. As your testing landscape evolves, so should your test cases. With a well-organized repository, the process of maintaining and updating your test cases becomes streamlined. Need to add a new test case? Update an existing one? Swap test cases between suites. The organized structure allows you to do so with minimal effort, ensuring that your testing repository remains agile and adaptable. Consider the scenario where a new team member joins your testing endeavor. An organized repository serves as an efficient onboarding tool, allowing them to quickly grasp the testing landscape. Navigating through suites and subsuites becomes a seamless process, accelerating the integration of new team members into the testing workflow. Now, let's explore the methodologies to bring order to your test case repository. There are three methodologies, hierarchical structure, functional or feature-based and priority or risk-based. Organizing test cases in a hierarchical structure with suites and subsuites provides a logical and intuitive framework. This makes it easy to navigate and understand the relationships between different sets of test cases. Grouping test cases based on functionality or features helps align testing efforts with the software's functional aspects. This approach aids in targeted testing and ensures comprehensive coverage. Prioritizing or organizing test cases based on their criticality or risk level allows teams to focus on high-impact areas first. This is especially valuable in scenarios with time constraints. Let's explore different types of repository organizations that cater to various testing needs. There are three types of repository organizations. Linear organization, matrix organization, hybrid organization. In the world of test case management, simplicity can be key. Linear organization offers a straightforward approach, particularly suitable for smaller projects or those with fewer dependencies. Now imagine you're working on a small project, perhaps an e-commerce website launch. With linear organization, your test cases could flow seamlessly from one to the next. This streamlined approach allows for easy navigation and a quick overview of testing progress. Next up, we have the matrix organization a versatile structure that facilitates cross-functional testing. This type of organization becomes invaluable when your testing involves multiple dimensions, such as browsers, devices, or operating systems. Consider a scenario where you're testing a mobile application across various devices and operating systems. A matrix organization allows you to efficiently organize test cases, ensuring comprehensive coverage across the diverse landscape of your testing matrix. Now, let's explore the best of both worlds with a hybrid organization. This approach combines elements of linear and matrix structures, offering flexibility and adaptability for a wide range of projects. Picture a project with both core functionalities and specific device browser requirements. 
a hybrid organization enables you to maintain a linear structure for core test cases while incorporating a matrix-like arrangement for specialized testing needs. It's the perfect blend of simplicity and flexibility. As we conclude our journey through repository organization in case, remember that the key is to tailor your structure to the unique needs of your projects. Whether you prefer a hierarchical, functional, or risk-based approach, the goal is clarity, efficiency, and a streamlined testing process. So go ahead, organize your repository, and watch your testing endeavors flourish.